Hey everyone, here with a quick video on Britney Spears. 2023 seems to be the year of the memoirs, okay? Write your memoir. Just like Jada Pickett Smith, Britney Spears, whose book comes out on October the 24th, she's telling all the secrets too. Uh-huh, telling all the business. She said when her and Justin Timberlake were dating back when they was only 19 years old, she got pregnant. And they decided together to not have the baby. Are you going to get this memoir? Listen, everybody, we're going to get more into this story right after this. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and share a screen with y'all. Let's get into this story right away. Mm, mm, mm. Brittany. Brittany Spears' memoir, Justin Timberlake got me pregnant. Both agreed not to have the baby. Brittany Spears has what insiders have described as a bombshell in her upcoming memoir, and multiple sources tell TMZ. The bombshell is that Justin Timberlake got her pregnant, and after some heart-wrenching discussions, they agreed she should get an abortion. Multiple sources with direct knowledge of the book tell TMZ Brittany felt Justin was the love of her life when they were together, and around the late 2000s, she learned she was pregnant. She says in the book she was raised not to get an abortion. Part of it was religious and part of it was just she learned from her family. In the book, Brittany writes, I love Justin so much. I always expected us to have a family together one day. That um, This would be just um, much earlier than I anticipated. But she says Justin's felt they weren't ready because they were too young. Both were around 19 at the same time. You know what? This is respectfully. And you know, um, all the ladies out there, protect yourselves. Protect yourselves. Because anytime you have uh, sex, you can potentially get pregnant. So my thing is, if he thought they were too young to be parents, then you might have been too young to be doing the do. Especially doing the do with no protection. But I'll carry on because it takes two to tangle and they both were in this situation together, okay? According to the book, Brittany says she was conflicted. But after some difficult emotional discussions, they both agreed unalivened baby was the right decision. Justin and Brittany dated between 1999 and 2002. Two sources tell TMZ it was so serious Brittany wanted to marry Justin, but that obviously did not work out. Look how oh, she looks so innocent there, right? So cute. The decision to unalive the baby haunted Brittany for years, something she spoke about in private. Brittany ended up having her first child, Sean Preston, with husband Kevin Federline in 2005, and she had Jaden James in 2006. Of course, they reached out to uh, Justin's reps, and so far, no word back. He's not going to say anything. Are you buying this memoir? Brittany memoir, The Woman in Me, comes out October 24th. Now, I don't know what they did in this picture, but she looks amazing in this picture. Nothing like the videos that we see her dancing in. Anyway, guys, I love the picture. Photoshopped or not, whatever they did. I think it's a great title. I'm rooting for Brittany, but I do believe that Brittany... She needs a lot of help. She needs a lot of help. And, and right now, everything that's going on with her, when you see these videos of her dancing half naked and all kind of craziness in the background, I'm afraid. 
And I think that she has no one in her corner that truly cares about her. I think everybody that's in her corner right now are vultures. I think her mother only wants to get back in her life uh, so that she can take her money and live the good life. I think the father, you know, he's not doing well now. And even though the conservatorship may have seemed like extreme, at least we didn't see this side of Britney that we're seeing now. The answer probably is somewhere in the middle, some type of balance. Her having a conservatorship over her, but not the rings not be so tight. Now, y'all asked for Britney to be free. Now she's free. And now look. Listen, guys, chat with me in the comments. And when I get an opportunity, I will chat back. If you're not a subscriber, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that every time I upload a video, you will be notified. If you are a subscriber, welcome back. Everybody, thanks for watching. Hit the like button, people, and I'll see you in the next video. Chat with me. I will chat back.